Welcome back to Steve's Small Engine Saloon. So you find that your snowblower is really hard to push around. It's not running, you're just taking it from point A to point B. Really hard to push around. This is just a simple reminder for some of you who have snowblowers that may have forgot about this feature on most snowblowers. Even some of you small engine mechanics out there that are fixing these for people, maybe some of you forgot this too. That's all I'm doing. You'll see that I do have this jacked up a little bit so I can show you this properly. You hear this? You can hear that wheel as it spins. It's turning that transmission, that gearbox. That's what's creating the resistance on that. Most snowblowers have a way to disengage the wheels from the drive system so you can actually push that around easily when you're transporting it. On this snowblower right here, it's just this clip right here. You pull that clip out and you put it through that hole right there. And you don't have to put it in that hole, but that just keeps it keeps you from putting that in your pocket. And so you're not going to lose it. It's just a kind of a place to store it, right? And now watch this. Now that snowblower will freewheel around like nobody's business. But remember, when you actually start it up to actually start using it, you pull that lever down and uh, start to use it, it's not going to drive itself. You have to remember to take that clip, that pin, back out and put it through where it was before, and then it's going to work again properly. Short and sweet, just like I said, just a friendly reminder, and um, that's about it. PBR, cheers. Steve out.